Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the Elementor video series. In this video, I'll show you how to use the newly added Elementor editor top bar. I'll also show you if you do not want to use the editor top bar, how to disable the editor top bar. So we will see how to use it. And if you are not comfortable with the newly added editor top bar, you can disable that too. So let's go to one of the pages and let's go to edit with Elementor. Now, when I go to edit with Elementor, you will see this newly added editor top bar. Now, this was not the feature in previous versions of the Elementor Pro plugin. Now, this is the new version added to the Elementor plugin. Here you will see the top bar and let's see how we can use it. Now, here you will see the first icon that is the Elementor. This is the theme builder. Here you will see the theme builder. You can use the theme builder to create templates. This is the history. If you are editing the page, it will show the history, user preferences. And this is the keyboard shortcuts manage website if you click on it it will go to the dashboard of the wordpress website now next one is add element you can click on the plus sign and from here you will see all the elements that you want to add next one is site settings so these are the site settings that will apply to the entire website and this is the structure is nothing but the navigator previously it was known as navigator now it is a structure so it will show the different sections on this page. If I add one more section, you will see the new section added here. If I add one more, it will show it here. So this is basically the navigator. Now the next one is page settings. So here you will see the page setting. This is the name of the page, published, draft. If you want to hide title, you can hide the title. So these are basic settings of the page, page style, advanced settings. And this is the responsive mode. Right now it is set to desktop tablet and mobile this is how it will look on the mobile devices next one is search or the finder then help if i click on it it will go to the elementor elementor help page this is for the preview if you click on it it will show the preview next one is publish you can simply click on publish and it will publish the page here is a drop down it will save the draft or save as template now in the previous version you had the option to exit from this elementor editor now here in this top bar when you enable this top bar you do not have the option to exit from the elementor editor page if you want to go to dashboard or if you want to go back you need to click on this manage website and it will go to the dashboard of the entire website if you are not comfortable with this new elementor editor top bar then you can disable it and you can use the older structure of the Elementor editor. Let me show you how you can disable this editor top bar. Go to the dashboard. Here go to editor settings. Go to features. Here you will see editor top bar. You can simply inactive and click save changes. By default it is inactive. If you want to use the Elementor editor top bar, you can enable it. You can change the status to active and you will be able to use the Elementor top bar. Now we have it disabled. Now let's refresh it and let's see the older structure of the Elementor editor. And this is the older structure of the Elementor editor. You will not see the editor top bar and you will see all the options in the left hand side bar. Now, if you want to exit from this editor, you can simply click here and exit and it will go back to the dashboard of the WordPress website. So this is how you can use the editor top bar in Elementor. If you want to use it, you can change the status to active. If you do not want to use it, you can simply change the status to inactive and save the changes. So that's it for now. See you in the next video. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comments section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching Quick Tips.